Hey brothers and sisters, welcome to the channel. My brother and sister, I'm not going to go into great detail in this video, but something happened that just blew my mind, blew my mind. And I just wanted to jump on here to say to somebody right now who the situation seems to be changing for you. The current seem to be going against what you have been feeling in the spirit. It seems like the Holy Spirit or, or, the, or you are feeling around you that um, things are going this way. But somehow circumstances, legislation, the law, whatever. Things that are physical in the world are telling you no 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 the current is going the opposite direction the current is going in the opposite direction my brother and sister I want to tell you right now that you have been pre-approved in the mighty name of Jesus I want to tell you right now that you have been pre-approved in the mighty name of Jesus yes legislation might be changing the laws might be changing Yes, the, the, the rules might be changing, but guess what? You were already assessed. You were already assessed. And as such, you were approved way before the change. And as such, you already qualify. You see, you are sitting there right now and, and you are feeling like um, uh, I, I was already in a bad position. I was already in bad circumstances. Now with this change, what is happening is that I will not even stand a chance. With this change, I won't stand a chance. But the Holy Spirit keeps on telling you that mm -mm, baby, something is coming. Mm -mm, baby, something is happening. And what is happening? You are starting to let your mind win. You are starting to let your mind tell you that you won't even make it. You are starting to tell, let your mind tell you that you don't stand a chance but the Holy Spirit is waiting he is nudging you and saying no it's going to happen it is actually happening right now my brother and sister I just want to tell you right now you have been pre-approved it is already done it has been stamped and it is yours it is just waiting sitting and waiting for you to come and claim it in the mighty name of Jesus listen the Holy Spirit cannot come and tell you any lies the Holy Spirit cannot come and tell you things that are not from ex right in the chambers of heaven right where god and jesus christ sits that's what it's not me it's 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 scripture john 16 13 says but when he the spirit of truth comes he will guide you into all truth he will not speak on his own what will he then do he will only speak only what he hears. Where is the Holy Spirit hearing all these things? He is hearing these things in the chambers of heaven when your docket and your name comes up in the mighty name of Jesus. And what is he gonna do? He is gonna come and he will tell you what is yet to come. But you see, when the Holy Spirit hears these things in the heavenly realms and he needs to come and tell you these things on the earthly plane, what happens? The devil and his uh, demonic forces out there, what are they doing? They want to come and contradict that the, 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 the news. They want to come and plant words and seeds in your mind of doubt. They want to come and make sure that you don't take the action necessary now. To go and actually realize that you already have it the the enemy right now is trying to discourage you so that you don't move so that you are frozen you believe that you are handcuffed you believed that you're stuck on the wall the enemy is planting the seed so that you sit in your bedroom in doubt and you don't go to the bank and ask you don't go to the person next door and in question you don't go to the place where the answers and the revelation of the fact that you've been pre-approved, that your name was considered way before now. The devil and his demonic forces are trying to stop you, not knowing that somewhere out there your name is being called and you, you are not appearing. They are saying this person is, is due to, to receive this land. Where are you? You'd never appeared. You didn't rock up to the place. Why? Because you let the enemy, you let his, 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 his little minions come and tell you otherwise. But if you make your life centered around having the companion of the Holy Spirit, 
listening diligently to it where it says it, it looks like there's no path there but trust me keep going trust me my brother and sister you will get there and you will be asked why are you in this line do you not know you are meant to be in the vip section why are you queuing well, don't you know we've been waiting for you ma'am sir don't you know that we've been waiting for you to come and claim this inheritance? Why are you queuing in this long queue? Why are you suffering? Don't you know we've been waiting and there is water, there is air conditioning, there is provision, there is a room waiting for you to come and just sign and claim this thing that has been pre-allocated for you in the mighty name of Jesus. My brother and sister, what you are feeling what you are feeling, what the Holy Spirit is telling you can only be truth. Why? Because the Holy Spirit cannot tell you any lie. Further, it cannot tell you things that it thinks. You see, we come and I can advise you as a friend and say, I think, but the Holy Spirit can only tell you what God and Jesus Christ out there in the heavenly realm have discussed about you in the mighty name of Jesus. Rebuke any negative thoughts rebuke those mental tom um, torments rebuke them and say i will go where my father says i should go in the mighty mighty name of our savior jesus christ amen